what is up guys welcome to the big unbox where we do that small tech and today i am back with another big unboxing for you for the one plus six and today we're back with the case from tudia this is going to be their merge series case to unbox i'll do a quick review i'll throw up the link in the video description this is going to be their heavy duty case so it's going to be like that dual layer case kind of like the otterbox commuter that we just reviewed so i do a little bit of comparison between the two because the pricing on this one's definitely a lot cheaper you're looking at ten dollars and ninety cents on amazon it looks like it comes in matte black you got a silver color and think that's the one i got you got this mint gray and then pink so a few different color options and the price is definitely on point so presentation wise looks like other 2d products you know decent decent packaging 2d right there nothing really to it and the back you can actually see what you're actually going to get so looks like a heavy duty case feels like it's going to be legit so we'll also check it to see if it's compatible with that official one plus six temper glass screen protector which the otterbox was definitely not guys i was an epic fail which you know you kind of expected that but you would hope that since they're they're actually releasing that on their own website that that would be compatible with their uh their temper glass screen protector but what can you do put that to the side Here's the actual case itself. I actually really like this case in the past for the past OnePlus. I think the OnePlus 5 and the OnePlus 5T had this one. So it's going to be a dual layer case. It's got a, basically a soft finish to it. It's like a matte finish on the back of it. The transitions to like this rubber bumper all the way around as well. So it's got a, it's a two part case. You can pull this off. You can do that right there. So you can pull this off. This is going to be your hard shell case on the back. You got the 2D Emerge branding right there and again this is one real hard shell case but it does have a soft feel and it does add some nice little grip to it as well so this is going to be the interior shell and it's got this rubber finish to it obviously you got a little bit of 2d of branding on the inside got that web type finish and it's actually got a very nice quality to it flexible material but then obviously when you put the two together you're actually getting some nice protection because that's that dual layer process that'll give you some nice drop protection hopefully let's go and check it out guys we'll put it in first things first i'm kind of curious to see if this is going to be compatible with that official k or official tempered glass screen protector because the other 2d case that i reviewed actually was i think this is the arc series and this one actually was so i definitely recommend that one so we'll put that in very tightly good to go nothing to it pop it on like this again dual air case heavy duty protection looks beautiful let's check this out i like the way that looks the, i think the black looks a little bit sleeker simply because it's just got that black on black but i actually do like the way the silver looks as well so you got the smooth finish got just a little to do your branding on the back and again it transitions to this rubber bumper very nicely done the cutouts very precise it's a little bit deep i'm not gonna lie about that i wish they would have done a little bit better with the transition the drop off is really really pretty far to get to the fingerprint sensor that's one thing i wish they would have cleaned up just a little bit they did okay with the actual transition but i think they could have done a little bit cleaner where it's smoother transition and not such a far drop off but it you know you can't complain too much but that would be the one thing i would complain about and then you got the camera protection as well got some heavy duty camera protection you can look at right there no issues at all with camera protection there and again it does have some nice weight to it extra weight it's got some nice grip to it as well with that bumper one thing let's check this out so they actually did a nice job with this i am impressed they had some extra grip on the sides as well you can see that little ridges that's going to give you some extra grip on the sides when you're holding the phone so that's really nice so it's not as slippery as some of these type of cases would be volume up and down clicking responsive let's check out those ports look clean and precise all the way across the board looks very nicely done power buttons clicky alert slider let's check out that angle it's pretty easy to get to actually they did a really nice job because it's completely flush right there so it's really actually pretty easy to get to with no issues at all so if you guys have big fingers shouldn't have any issues at all getting to it all right let's do this let's check out that lip before i start squeezing on to see if it's compatible you can see the lip protection just a little bit of lip. well i mean it's, it's actually a lot of lip protection because i do have I'm rocking that tempered glass screen protector so it's quite a bit of lip protection it's edge to edge protection so you see it's kind of raised up just a little bit it's not quite as big a lip as the otterbox but again, you guys can see when you're rocking that tempered glass screen protector, you're getting some thickness with that as well. So when you combine the two, it's actually some nice, you can see right there, that's a good view where that lip protection is going. Now let's check out the squeeze, squeeze factor here. I'm squeezing it, I'm squeezing it. 
Guys, this appears to be compatible with that temper glass screen protector, that official one. No issues at all. I'm squeezing it. No issues at all. So I would say if you guys are looking for a heavy duty case, go with this one over the OtterBox. You're gonna save quite a bit. Of, let's check out the difference here. This is gonna be a little bit more heavy duty, but again, you, and you're getting some more lip protection, but with this OtterBox, what it does is that lip, you can see how it almost curves in. So what it does is that pushes that timber glass screen protector out. And then from that, it's really not compatible. It's a little more bulky, but you can see the differences. It's pretty close because you are got that two piece case. I do like this back a lot better as well. It's a little bit more sleek feeling. This is a little more slippery. This actually has a better grip to it as well. And then plus it's actually compatible with the official temper glass screen protector. So when you got that, Look at that, you, you're protected. So if you do drop it, obviously you're probably gonna, it's probably gonna impact something, but you're covered edge to edge. So it's gonna hit, probably hit that screen protector or that lip first and probably not gonna knock anything. The only thing that's really exposed, so obviously you got the top part right there on the notch, it's exposed, that's pretty much it. So overall guys, if you guys are looking for a cheap case that's heavy duty, I would go with this one over the OtterBox because you can see the slim factor too. Let's check out the thickness real quick before I let you guys go. You can see it's a little bit sleeker, a little bit slimmer than this one as well. So I would say this one's gonna be a hit. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button. We'll see you guys next time.